Welcome back. A, a local organization is empowering future change makers right here in our area. We love this. We're talking about the sixth annual Philanthropy Tank Palm Beach Finals. And joining us this morning is finalist Pierre Lewis and Philanthropy Tank CEO Amory Brand. Good morning to you both. Hi there. Good morning. So, Amy, for everybody who doesn't know, I'm going to start with you. What is Philanthropy Tank? Sure. Well, Philanthropy Tank is a program that started about six years ago, and it empowers our young people who have ideas for addressing social change issues in their community to apply for an opportunity to pitch their idea. And potentially, if they're awarded funding, they have the opportunity to be um, backed by being launched, their program being launched, and receiving mentorship from some of the wonderful philanthropists in our community. All right, Pierre Louis joining us as well. You know, Pierre, first off, tell us, you know, how old are you and where do you go to school? Sure, I'm 18. I'm a senior in high school at Spanish River. All right. In Boca Raton. And Pierre, tell us about your idea. How are you going to win Philanthropy Tank? <laughs> um, well, I launched an organization called Orange Math Tutoring. We seek to provide underprivileged students in kindergarten through fifth grade with a strong foundation in mathematics. And I hope that I'm able to resonate with the philanthropy take mentors in the sense that I'll be able to show them that uh, I'm helping lift kids from uh, uh, poverty potentially to uh, a great future. And Pierre, where'd you come up with this idea? Oh, really, I just looked around in class and realized that I was one of the only minority students in the class and I was a bit concerned. So I did some research and found out that the problem really starts at the foundational level in elementary school. All right, well, if I'm one of the judges, I'm giving it to Pierre because I love this idea, Amy. But what, <laughs> tell us a little bit about what, how these investors and mentors are going to be able to, to measure these ideas between each other and how do they pick the winner? You know, well, the, the applications assess the proposal of the project itself, its feasibility, um, the opportunity for it to be sustainable and something that will impact in terms of longevity in the community. So it's really, these students do a lot of groundwork and researching what are the issues, what are they passionate about, where is something that they see that they can jump in and make a real change or elevate something that's happening in the community and be able to, to add a different perspective to the issue. So I think our investors are looking for things that they really can help with their expertise lift to a different level and to establish and create some network opportunities in the community to be able to provide resources. So all those things come into play when assessing the projects and the students. And Amy, what happens after, you know, a project is awarded some money? You know, how do they take it next level from there? Well, they go into the process like any nonprofit. They do a 90 day strategy plan, a business plan, they look at how they can brand themselves. What are they offering? How are they different from other things that exist in the community? And how they're going to be able to, again, add some different perspective on a solution that they can uh, be able to really hit the ground running with. These are all student-led philanthropists. So it's all them. It's just us helping and provide some guidance. It's going to be tough to choose. Right, tough to choose one, projects. right? Wow. Well, the it's extremely tough. And, you know, we hope that we can support all the students because they've really done a great deal to get this far to the finals. And you can watch the finals uh, on Tuesday, March 30th uh, from 7 to 8. All you can do is go to philanthropytank.org and you can see these uh, incredible young people pitch their ideas. Amy, thank you so much. Pierre, uh, good luck good with luck. Orange Math. Uh, and thank you so thank much you. for joining us. Thank you both.